Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make glow-in-the-dark homemade slime. Ingredients you'll need are glue. This can be white glue or clear glue, just regular cuts and cracks glue. And some water. Now, you're going to need a lot more than that, but that's just for example. Borax. And then the magic ingredient, which is glow-in-the-dark powder, which I got this off eBay for 75 cents. And things you'll need to make the slime. A whisk, I have a mini one. You need a half teaspoon, a little measuring cup, half cup. And I'm also going to be using just one of these big measuring cups with all sorts of measurements and then just two decent sized bowls alright to start making this slime you need some water one and a half cups actually so I have one and a half cups in here and we're gonna need to split that up a little bit so it's one of your bowls let's fill it with half a cup of water just a little bit more and then your other bowl let's fill the rest in one cup of water and that is all the water we need now the bowl that has a cup of water we're going to need to add some borax into so with your half teaspoon measuring cup fill it with borax I'm just going to do this upside down a little bit. There we go. Let me just scoop some out. There we go. Just put that in the water. And then we are going to mix that up. And this warm water will dissolve the borax much easier than it would in cold water. So let's do this until borax is dissolved into the water. And now, with the bowl with half cup of water, we are going to add our glow-in-the-dark powder. Now I don't know exactly how much powder this is, but it's a very small amount, and it weighs about 0.3 ounces. I don't really think it matters that the amount you use just as much as it's not too much so I'm going to just add this in small amounts and see how it works alright so I went ahead and used the whole bag of the glow powder and it seems to have mixed in very well So. Next, what we need, I'm going to put this off to the side actually, is our glue. So I'm going to take this half cup measuring cup and fill it all the way with the glue, and then I'm going to put it in here. Alright, so there's the cup, half cup, and I'm just going to add it right in. I'm just going to try and get as much glue out of here as possible. And I'm just going to add just a little bit more glue because there's some still in the measuring cup. Just a little bit. That should be good. Alright. Now we're just going to mix this together. Alright, we are at the final part. So we have our glue water glow mixture here this is the base and we also have our borax water now all we need to do is just make sure this is mixed very well and now just pouring the water into the glue and then just mix together and instantly you can see we have our slime I'm just going to do a little mixing just 
to make sure we get as much slime as possible. Good consistency there. All right. So now that that's all mixed together, it's not done yet. We just need to pretty much reach in and grab the slime, transfer it over to this bowl, our empty bowl, which the water was in. And the reason why is because there's a lot of water left over and there's nothing you can do about that. And as you can see, all the water in there. Let's try and get as much of the slime out as possible. We're going to have to do this a couple of times back and forth. Because even though we just pulled all the slime out, uh, water still will uh, drain out of the slime. So, just got to do that a couple of times. And then uh, we'll test the glow in the dark. Alright, so I got this bowl that had the water in it. Empty that out. Now all of our slime. We're going to do the same thing. Just grab it out. Just put it in this bowl. And as you can see, there's barely any water left in this bowl, which is a great thing. So it looks like now our slime is ready. So now we have our slime. And uh, just a quick test, tip the bowl. And if you see any water coming out, then you just need to do that uh, switch back and forth process with the two bowls a couple more times. And uh, now it's pretty much solid. I mean, it's kind of like liquidy. It's, it's slime, right? So, yeah, you can just grab some out, and uh, there it is, that's our slime. So now we have to do the glow-in-the-dark test, of course, right? So, I have this light here, which I'm just going to clamp onto the tripod, and we're just going to put some light on that for a really good glow effect. And then in a couple minutes, I'll turn off all the lights. Alright guys, so I moved into a room that is very easy to darken with all the lights off. There are no windows, so I'm going to just turn off all the lights in the room. Now the only light is left on is our incubator light here. So I'm going to turn that off and see how it glows. Three, two, one. Wow guys, look at that. You can see. It is so bright, that glow-in-the-dark slime. I know what you're probably thinking, like, oh, it's only glowing because I have this super strong, bright light on it, right? Well, let's just turn on the regular lights in this room. Turn off this powerful light. And now we're just going to wait a couple minutes in the dark to let the glow die down. Now we'll just turn on the regular house lights and then see how that glows. It's pretty much dead. So, we'll go ahead and turn on the lights. And just wait a couple minutes and then we'll turn the lights back off. You can see the difference in the glow. Alright, it's been about a minute or two and I'm going to go ahead and turn off the lights here. And yeah, as you can see, it just... Alright, so as you can see, the glow down a lot and now just this is a very easy to make glow so you just need like a flashlight and I'm pretty sure everyone has a phone with a flashlight so I'm gonna do that just got mine out right here I'm just gonna hold it there just for a couple of seconds and just take it away and as you can see the glow goes up so now if we hold it there just for a minute or two, it'll be glowing pretty good. Alright. So I'm just going to bring that big light on it again. And then we'll just get... One final look at it. Yeah, there it is. The camera's picking it up good now. I think I just need a little light in the background. But yeah. So there's a uh, glow in the dark slime. 
pretty easy recipe and uh hope you guys have fun with it thanks for watching leave a like comment if you want and be sure to subscribe all right see you guys next time